Howdy everyone, Pete Daddy here. We've got a big objective today. Dynamic Duo is back. This time we get two Belgian players from Dortmund. 93 rated Thomas Mounier and 95 rated Axel Witzel. And you know that's worthy of the Whopper button. Tell the crew to push the Whopper button. I'm going to go over the best way, the fastest way. I'm going to share with you some tips on how to dominate this objective. But before we begin, if you're new here, please make sure to subscribe down below. I'd really appreciate it. First, though, I'd like to point out, if you guys haven't noticed, there's another objective out there for a Dortmund player. So you are talking three strong footies players, all from Dortmund, that you can bring into your club for free. So that is a nice boost that a Kanji card is nice, Witzel is nice, and Mounier is nice. And they would form a triangle. You could have them center back, right back, CDM with uh, three strong links. Witzel and Mounier are, of course, a perfect link or hyperlink, whatever you want to call it. So that makes it even better that they link up like that. But let's go over what you need to do, and I'll share with you some players. And we've got a bonus. I have my 90-plus five times players pack ready to open so before we show the team i'll show you guys or show you guys some of the players to use we'll open up that pack and maybe we'll get somebody we can use as well but first things first we have five different sections defensive dynamo you have to score two goals using defenders in the live foot friendly bundesliga basic so notice it's in a live foot friendly the only downside is a kanji is in squad battles so you cannot grind for a kanji and witzel and Mounier at the same time you're going to have to get a kanji from squad battles or rivals and you'll have to get uh, witzel and Mounier from the friendly so that's the only thing that does stink a little bit but they are out there available for free just for grinding the game so keep that in mind but two goals using defense Defenders, um, you know, there's tons of great ones. Alfonso Davies, you know, anybody that's a left back, center back, right back, you, you can use them. That will count as your defenders. Sometimes even from corners it comes through. But one thing to point out, though, is it seems like in the Bundesliga Basics, most of the people are playing, are going to play Golden Goal. I've heard that on the Discord server. So if you're new here as well, make sure to check the description. Join my Discord server. So you may not be able to just play it out and get a corner or something like that. So you may need to have a defender as a striker. So you may need to put someone like even Jordi Alba, anyone that's got a little bit of pace that can get free, get in behind somebody, maybe can bury something like that. So just any defender with pace. I know we've had Footy's Tavernier recently. That's one that would work out. So there's tons of good defenders that you could use just to bang in two goals. Next one, find victories. Score using Belgian players and five separate wins in the live foot friendly Bundesliga basics. That is what will get you the footies Mounier. So I will say if you do not feel like doing this entire grind to also get Vetzel, make sure you at least do this for Mounier. Again, people from the Discord were saying they were getting Mounier done in less than 15 minutes. So to get that card into your club in less than 15 minutes, I think is more than worth it. So just keep that in mind. All you have to do is score using Belgian players. And remember, most people are going to play Golden Goal and definitely I'm recommending you play Golden Goal. So you want if you've only got one Belgian player in attack, you're going to have to really force feed it to them because I know for me, personally if you score with someone else i just leave the match because that's that's just the way it's going to have to work i feel like so make sure that if you need to score with a belgian player that you score with your belgian player scoring stats score 15 goals in the live foot friendly bundesliga basics this should just happen naturally even if we're playing golden goal the minimum grind which we'll see in a minute is 13 matches so if you have 13 golden goal wins that's 13 of the goals Hopefully everyone plays Golden Goal and you just play two more Golden Goal games. But if you have one game where someone doesn't leave early, you know, don't sweat it. Don't get angry. Don't get upset. Just make sure you score three goals in that one. And then hopefully everyone else plays Golden Goal. So score 15 goals should be fairly simple. Score using Bundesliga midfielders in three separate matches. This one should be fairly simple as well. Now remember, midfielders are left mid, right mid, CM, CAM, CDM. And it's what's on their card before they go to the match. So right there on this card, you can see Witzel as a CDM. He would count as a midfielder. But if you position modified Witzel to a striker for chemistry purposes, for whatever reason, Witzel now counts as a striker or as a forward. So it's what's on the card before you go into the match, regardless of where you play him. If you have Witzel as a striker, but you play him as a CDM, he doesn't count as a CDM or a midfielder. He counts as a striker. It's what's on the card 
before you go into the match. So left mid, that's another thing to keep in mind. If you have a left winger or right winger, may, may need a position, modify them to left mid and right mid because that just counts as a midfielder. If they're a left wing, that's a forward. Or a left forward, that's a forward. So it's, it's kind of weird on that that you can have one card count for a midfielder count as an attacker, but that, that's just the way it works in this one. But it's what's on the card before you go into the match. And then playing partners. This is the one that's a little bit tough. Assist using footies, Mounier, and eight separate matches. So once you get Mounier, you're really going to have to move him up to like striker or something like that because it's going to be your responsibility to make sure that Mounier is the one that is going to give you your assist when you score. So it's going to be a little bit hard, a little bit tricky to make sure, okay, get it to Mounier. Mounier's got to pass. That person's got to score. But also keep in mind, if you're taking a corner or something like that, make sure you change it to Mounier taking the corner because if you score direct from that corner, then that would be one of your Mounier assists. So keep that in mind. That is one of the things that's going to make it a little bit hard. But Mounier has enough stats where he should be fine. The problem is, and we'll look at his stats in just a minute, he's six foot three, So he's going to feel a little bit stiff when you get him up in attack, but he's got enough stats to where I think it's going to make up for it and more than enough passing. So hopefully that'll work out just fine on that one. Let's open up our 90 plus pack right here. We've got a 90 plus times five. Let's see if we can get anything good. Five 90, 90 plus rated rare players pack. Come on. Did it say they were all from footies team two? That was interesting. I just kind of read that over there. Is everything guaranteed to be from footies? That would be interesting. Walk out. Okay, so I think, is that team, I hope that's team of the season flair. Uh, we're going to get a cheeky little Kalor Navas. We're going to have to pop him into the Nanny SBC. So 94 rated Navas. Now, the one good thing about this, and I'm starting to think about this, and I should have even mentioned this, one of the biggest benefits of both Witzel and Mounier, we have Weekend League Plus going right now for Bundesliga. So you need at least eight Bundesliga players in your starting squad for your Weekend League team to get those extra red picks. But, well, I've mentioned that because this Navas, you know, normally I'd be thinking, okay, that's fodder. But in two weeks, we should be having the League on Weekend League Plus. Next week should be the Serie A. The following week should be the League on. So I may want to hold on to that Navas until I'm done with the League on Weekend League Plus. Just something to keep in mind as you get some of these players. But let's see what else we got. It's not going to be Neymar. We did get Fakir. Okay, we got Bailey. Bailey's actually one of the cards I was going to point out. So... Bailey, that will be very nice for Bundesliga challenges. We also got Reyna, who could be nice for Bundesliga challenges. We get the foot birthday, Luka Modric. So nothing here that I'm super excited about. Bailey could come in handy for our Bundesliga team. Reyna could, could possibly come in handy, or maybe if I make a U.S. team at some point, I don't know. Fakir, we've already done a French challenge. Uh, did we do, we did La Liga too. Did we do French I think we did La Liga. I don't know. All of it's running together. I know we did a French one. For some reason, I'm having a blank on if we did a La Liga one. Yeah, we did La Liga. We did La Liga. Never mind. So Fakir is one. I'll probably pop into an SBC. Modric, I'll definitely pop into an SBC. All of them will go into an SBC, but you just, what I'm saying, you want to make sure you use them in your weekend League Plus teams maybe before you get rid of them. Okay, let me show you a couple players that you might want to keep in mind as you play. And I'll just, I'll point this out as well here. When you go into the friendly and why I'm mentioning some of these players, you would go to play online. We're talking Bundesliga basics. You need minimum six Bundesliga players. So that keep that in mind. When you go into that friendly, you got to have at least six Bundesliga players. So that's the main key when you're first starting out. So the first thing that you have to take advantage of when you go or have to complete when you go into this, you have to score in five separate match, five separate wins with a Belgian player. And I looked at my team, like, let's take a look at this. You know, if I went and looked, you know, a lot of our teams I know are spent. So I went, I was like, okay, who do I have from Belgium? Oh my God. You know, I don't have anybody from Belgium. I just have a 74 rated. So I was like, what am I going to do? So I went and kind of scouted out some good value Belgian players. The best value of all is this team of the season, Carrasco. You can see I bought him there today, just like an hour ago, for 21,000 coins. This is a phenomenal card for 21,000 coins. The only bad thing is I've got to score with Carrasco. I have to score with Carrasco in those five matches to get the... Uh, 
to bring Mooney into my team. So I'm going to have to force feed it to Carrasco, but very, very good card. Now, I didn't put the Hawk on him. I probably wouldn't recommend a Hawk. I may put a finisher on him, something like that. And maybe what I do, I'll have to look at him a little bit more. But Carrasco is the best value. And then we're kind of going up a little bit. Mertens is around 100000 which I would say is a good value. But you don't necessarily need to buy him just for this challenge. But that is a good value card for that. De Bruyne's team of the season cards right around 130,000 coins. Another very solid card. And this Festival of Football Path to Glory Hazard card. Eden Hazard card is one of the best cards I've played with all year. And he goes, let me check. I want to say 270,000, but it may be 370,000. Let me just check on that real quick. Uh, let me just search him up before I tell you guys wrong. Let me change, change this to Path to Glory. And he's going for, let me just put it down to 300. I mean, I, like I said, I don't want to tell you guys wrong. 320, not not for 320, 350. So right around that 340 range, which again, this is an absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal card. I played with him many, many weekend leagues. And, you know, that is, like I said, 320,000, 350,000 coins is a lot of money to put into a card just for this challenge. I would say that's someone you'd want to put into your main team if you can get them fit in or if you don't have someone better, another better option. But Hazard's a great, great, great card for that price. De Bruyne is a great card. Mertens is a great card. Carrasco is the best value Belgian card. Now, if you're someone, and I understand it, if you can't scratch two pennies together right now in FIFA, and I understand we've all been there. The game is just eating up our resources, giving us so much content. I would say this Trossard, who is a gold common, gold rare cards are very expensive right now. Commons are about the only place you can find any decent value. So if you need a Belgian player to score some goals and you can't come up with even 20,000 coins, then this Trossard is probably one of the best values. And there's one there that you maybe could get for 500 coins. So that's what I would say would be the best value card. Now, what you're playing for is this Vitzel and Mounier. This Vitzel card is absolutely outstanding. The only downside that somebody invited me to play Minecraft. I don't even know. Myself invited me to play Minecraft, apparently. But the only downside about this Vitzel is he is forced, I mean, not forced, he's medium, medium. I've never been a big fan of medium, medium in the midfield. Some people don't mind it. For me personally, it just seems like sometimes they get lost. But Vitzel's got enough stats and maybe he can recover from that. Just absolutely phenomenal stats. 97 strength, 90 aggression, 93 defensive awareness. I've seen some people even putting engines on him to boost the agility, boost the balance, boost the passing a little bit. I would probably still put Anchor on him or possibly Shadow, but I probably Anchor is what I would go with on the Vitzel. On Mounier, Mounier though, even though he is six foot three, as I mentioned, he does have 91 agility. So he's going to feel okay, I would say. His defensive awareness is actually a little poor. He would be interesting to try out as a center back. Now, I know some people that has a little bit of a stigma playing the right back to center back. I personally don't mind playing people wherever you want to play them. Then, you know, it's up to your opponent to deal with it. But 99 strength. The aggression's a little weak. But this that could be a very, very good card as a center back. Maybe put an anchor on him to boost the aggression a little bit. Or you could put a shadow on him to make him 99 acceleration and 99 sprint speed. Boost the defensive awareness on But that could be a phenomenal card to play with the Mounier. As far as Bundesliga options that are good values, I'd mention the Akanji. He's available for free as an objective. Sané is an SBC that's out there right now. I'm going to complete Sané to help with my Weekend League Plus team. Then I may end up using them in an SBC or something like that. Maybe I'll say as a super sub, but if you're going to get Sané, then you know, definitely use him for your Bundesliga team. Then we have some good value ones. We just popped that Leon Bailey. He's going for right around 20,000 coins. Emre Chan foot birthday is around 15, 16, 17,000 coins. Sabitzer is going for about 24,000 coins. This Nkunku was about 15, 16, 17, 18, somewhere in that neighborhood. And Hwanki Chan foot birthday, uh, one of our starter team legends, his regular gold card. Definitely another great Bundesliga card that you could use that is a phenomenal value. Now, of course, if you've got a Goretzka team of the season, if you've got Summer Stars Kimmich, if you've got Team of the Year Lewandowski, you know, some of these phenomenal Bundesliga cards, you know, don't worry about this, but I'm trying to help you guys out with some good value cards so you don't have to break the bank and do anything like that. But anyways, guys, this is going to wrap it up for now. Thanks so much for watching. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe down below. Check the description, join my Discord server, but I will see you guys soon. Take care. Bye.